Hey, what's up, my awesome friends? It's your buddy Kenator here, and today I've got a hot new update for you about Outpost Infinity Siege. So buckle up and get ready for a ride because we've got a lot to cover. First things first, let's address the big old news. Outpost Infinity Siege has pushed its launch back to February next year. Now before you go and get disappointed, let me tell you why this delay is actually a blessing in disguise. Trust me, I've been lucky enough to be part of all the testing phases so far, so let me assure you, the wait will be worth it. You see, the devs wanted to deliver us the most polished and kick-ass experience possible, and that's why they've decided to just take a little bit of extra time. And you know what? I couldn't agree more. I mean, rushing things can just lead to mistakes, and we don't want that, right? So let's give the developers the space they need to work their magic. But speaking of magic, there's a whole galaxy of games coming out between now and when Outpost was supposed to launch, including the massive Starfield, Baldur's Gate 3, which is now already out, and Armored Core 6. Whew, that's some tough competition. So the delay might have also been a strategic move to ensure that we, the Outpost fans, get all the love and attention we deserve. Now listen up, because there's more. The good folks over at the publisher Lightning Games treated us to a 12 minute developer interview with Team Ranger, the genius minds behind Outpost Infinity Siege. And let me tell you, this has got to be one of the most honest and transparent dev interviews I've seen in a long time. Sharing their journey from day one, the challenges they faced as a small but expanding team, now they crafted this unique blend of shooter, base defense and RTS. It's like they've opened the vault to their game development journey, and it's a must watch. You'll find the link for both this video and the new trailer in the description, but in case you don't watch it, the team comes across, at least to me, like they genuinely care about the game and making sure that us as players get the best they can give us. It also takes a lot for devs to admit mistakes and show a more human side of themselves, and more so to do it so openly. If only more devs could be a bit more open like these guys and girls, maybe the gaming community wouldn't be so up in arms every time there's a delay announcement. Now let's dive into the future of Outpost Infinity Siege. What can we expect during these extra four to five months of waiting? Well, more testing, my friends. They've previously conducted tests regularly every about two to three months, and through our help, we can make the game even more epic. So if you want to get in on the action, join their Discord community, link again below, where they announce everything first. Secondly, and this is just my speculation based on my testing experience here, we should end up with a lot more enemy types. I've seen plenty of new units added throughout testing, and I've definitely noticed a few new units that I've not seen before in the new trailer as well. This will certainly help bring extra variety and challenge to the game. And thirdly, as they mentioned in the video, Team Ranger values are encouragement, and it keeps their motivation sky high. So let's show them some love, shall we? Tweet them, message them on Discord, or leave a comment right here telling them what aspects of the game you are most stoked about. Is it the bases, the mechs, the gun customization, or just the exhilarating chaos of a base assault? You decide. If you have any other questions about the game, just drop it in a comment below and I'll be all over it like a mech on a mission. I'm here for you, my fellow Outpost Commanders. And hey, if you're new here and you want to catch up on more Outpost Infinity Siege content, I've got not one, but two other videos to get you caught up, and they're just a click away right here on your screen. Now don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for all the gaming goodness, and I'll catch you in the next one. Until then, stay awesome, stay pumped, and I'll see you soon. Kenator, out.